Oswald the Lucky Rabbit, Disney's original Mickey Mouse, is back to help celebrate the studio's 100th anniversary. But will he be sticking around for long? For the first time in almost 95 years, Walt Disney Animation has released a brand new, traditionally hand-drawn Oswald the Lucky Rabbit cartoon. This one simply titled Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. The cartoon, uploaded online by Disney, is incredibly simple. Seeing Oswald entering a movie theatre playing one of his cartoons, where he's greeted by some classic 1920s rubber hose barnyard animals who fill up the crowd. Up on the screen, screen appears Ozzy's love interest, Hortensia, who first appeared alongside Ozzy in 1927. The final 30 seconds of this mere one minute cartoon sees Ozzy trying to break his way into the screen to be with his love, in an incredibly hilarious run of classically inspired cartoon gags. Ozzy does eventually break through by cartoon's end, with the two are finally reunited. The cartoon has been produced by Walt Disney and animation to celebrate the 100th anniversary of the Disney Company as part of the studio's 100 Years of Wonder campaign, launched at the D23 Expo earlier this year and set to run right throughout 2023. It follows a short film recently released by Disney, Mickey in a Minute, which was included in the Disney Plus docufilm Mickey Story of a Mouse. In fact, the Oswald short shares the same production team as Mickey in a Minute, with animation by Disney Animation's hand-drawn team, including Mark Henn, Randy Haycock, and Eric Goldberg, who also directed the shorts. Goldberg said of the Oswald short, Oswald is such a plucky scamp. We wanted to bring Oswald back, and in the short, he quite literally returns to his original home, the movie screen. We wanted to have Oswald do all of the squash and stretch rubber hose animation style, celebrating that first generation of Walt Disney's art. While this is touted as Walt Disney Animation's first Oswald cartoon in almost 95 years, the studio did release a digitally animated Oswald Christmas cartoon back in 2013, though this was technically produced by Walt Disney Animation Japan specifically for the Japanese market. Oswald was, of course, Walt Disney and Ub Iwerks' first cartoon star, debuting in 1927's Trolley Troubles. Disney produced a series of 20 27 Oswald cartoons before losing the rights to his distributor Charles Mintz and Universal Pictures. This swindle would eventually lead to the creation of Disney's now icon Mickey Mouse. Oswald would later go on to live an incredibly fruitful life at Universal, where his series of more than 140 cartoons was produced by Woody Woodpecker creator Walter Lance. Disney would regain the rights to Oswald in 2006, when then new Disney CEO Bob Iger let it crusade to return the character home. While Oswald was used heavily in the Epic Mickey video games, the aforementioned Christmas card cartoon, and has a presence at Disney's California Adventure Park, he's been very absent on screen for the best part of the last decade. If you'd like to learn more about Oswald, don't forget to check out my evolution video exploring his creation and near 100 year history in depth. A couple of years ago, rumours swirled that Disney was in active development on an Oswald cartoon series for Disney+, Plus, similar to the current wave of Mickey Mouse cartoons by Paul Rudish. However, earlier in the year, numerous outlets reported that the series had been cancelled. It is great to see though that the studio has had some kind of Oswald production in the works, and while this does appear to be a one-off, standalone short, it gives us the best indication of what an entire new series could be like. It really makes me hope that Disney could be pushed to create some more if this one gets a great reception. Regardless, if this is all that we get, it's great to see the studio recognising Oswald in some small way, instead of ignoring him altogether for the 100th anniversary, as they often do. And at that, I want to know what are your thoughts on the new Oswald cartoon, and would you like to see Disney produce a whole series of these? Join the conversation down in the comments below with all your thoughts.